I am a black Egyptian. My father is much darker than I am. My mother is lighter than I am. For our, the education of our viewership, why don't you share with us uh, a breakdown of Egypt as it is today, in so far as blacks or uh, combinations thereof of European descent, what have you? We don't have you. We don't have Egyptians of European descent in Egypt. We have a population which is basically the inter, uh, which is basically a mixture of ancient Egyptian blacks who intermarried with Arabs right after the Arab conquest. The ancient Egyptian population was brown and black before the Arab conquest. But, but before the Arab conquest came the Greeks. It was ancient, the ancient Egyptian population was in Egypt for thousands of years. The, the ancient Egyptian population was brown and black and the Greeks came in 300 BC and they started to intermarry with the local population and then the Romans came and ruled from 70 BC until they were con conquered by the Arabs and kicked out by the Arabs in the 7th century. And these people intermarried with the Egyptian Copts and, and, and they, made the, they, made, they made the pigmentation of the, of the Egyptians, the Copts, much lighter because of this intermarriage with Europeans. Now, you're an educator, okay? Now, how do you deal with situations uh, when you practice your profession in so far as dealing with the mythology or the misconceptions about Egypt uh, being a white civilization? How do you deal with that? Uh, this is a big problem because Egypt, the ancient Egyptian civilization was a black civilization and ancient Egyptians were black according to the Greek scholars and the Roman scholars. Ancient Egypt became white only in the 19th century and in the 20th century. And the scholar who is responsible for this is Seligman, the noted anthropologist from England, Seligman. White supremacy argues that blacks are inferior than white intellectually. They are subhuman and they are incapable of building a civilization. White supremacy had one dilemma until Seligman came. The dilemma was ancient Egypt was black according to the Greek and the Roman scholars. Ten of them said that, including uh, Aristotle and, and, and uh, Plato of them said that uh, in writing they had this dilemma ancient Egyptian was black so if blacks are inferior intellectually are, and are incapable of building a civilization how come the ancient Egyptians built a civilization Seligman found the solution for this dilemma he came up with a theory called the Hamite theory he separated the blacks who built a civilization in Egypt and Ethiopia from the rest of the black race and he called them brown skinned whites or the Hamites. So Seligman saved white supremacy from this dilemma and all the white scholar followed him from that, from that time on. This was at, at, the, at the end of the 19th century. And since that time, white scholarship says that ancient Egypt is, 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 is white.